all throughout the entire world, that people are declaring victory for Breonna Taylor, for Breonna Taylor, for Breonna Taylor. But the reality is, family, there was no victory. There was no justice. The reality is that a black woman was killed. There is no amount of money, there is no retribution when you are thinking about a life. A black woman's life! She was only 26 years old. My baby sister is 26 years old. This is not something that is foreign. This is something that is happening right now. Today, I don't like this day. I hate these, I hate these type of days. Because you just feel, you feel so much and you can't express that feeling accurately. You know, you can yell but you still feel that feeling because you know yelling is not gonna bring them back. So now we're all here fighting to make sure there's not another Breonna Taylor or George Floyd or Trayvon Martin or Tamir Rice. That is what we're fighting for. Because society told me I was supposed to hate myself. Come on. Because and hate my black sisters. Woo. Because of the color of my skin. I'm not doing that anymore. Thank you. In Brianna's honor. In Sandra Bland's honor. Yes! Yes! Come on! In too many black women whose names we don't even know honor. Yes! I stand with my sisters. I'm the mama bear. Mama bear. I'm the one who gonna tell y'all when s*** ain't right. Come on, right. talk about it! We got the been here. And I did this, and I done done this, and I know too many families. Come on! Too many families that are suffering because their loved one was cut down by the police. Come 
come on. Speak and that ain't right. I march with these people. Speak on it. I love these people. Woo! Talk about it. So when I say we out here for Brianna, when I say we out here for her mother, come on. That's right. When I say we lift up the name of Tamika Palmer, because That's until right. you lose a child, That's right. come on. Come on. Until you go to sleep and you wake up and somebody calls you and tells you that the police ran in your child's house, right. come on, talk about it. Tell them. And murdered her. Tell them. Talk about it. Tell them. When you raise her to be an independent black woman. Hello. Hello. When you raise her Woo. to yes. take care of others. Come on, talk about it. We will never, ever know what it feels like to be her. Come on. But let's not wait till it's us. You better say that. Because it's her, it's me. Come on, it's me too. Woo. This is my 18 year old daughter. Speak Woo. on it. We build a generation of liberators. Hello. Yes. Hello. have faith no matter what it is in life no matter how much they say that we think that they're not going to do something you should always talk positive into positive talking into life and I mean please believe justice will be served if not today tomorrow or whenever Good. Um, can you tell me how you feeling in this moment and uh, right now I'm feeling great um I'm out here with a bunch of people I don't know but I consider them all my family because right now we all out here for the same cause even you even these cops they out here to protect us they out here to destroy us but at the end of the day, they here. As you can see behind me, they playing their position like everybody else should. Mm -hmm. In this world, we gotta learn how to play our position. You know what I mean? Everybody is not our enemy, but we should always keep our eyes open to see That's the enemy. The, the enemy could be right next to you, but you have to be the one to be awoke to see that. I mean, just to piggyback off of, you know, what my bro just said, it is real out here. You know, everybody out here, you know what I mean, for, for different reasons. You know, you got some people that's out here for clout, you got some people that's out here just to front. You got some people that's out here just to say, hey, listen, this is what I'm doing right now because this is what's trending. Honk but that but, horn. but at the you. end of the day, when horn. all of this shit is over, talking, let me hear you. what are you that's really doing? Where, where are you really standing? Now, you see all of these cops right here. 
One of the things that I always say is we're constantly hollering at them, screaming at them, getting in their face. Part of my language on oh, camera, yeah. you, suck my d just that yells in the third. We can say all of that all we want to the police, but where's that gonna get us? That's not gonna get us nowhere. Mm -hmm. You really want the police to be on your side instead of screaming at them, take the time to sit down and talk with them. Guarantee, you, it's not, it's, it's, you're not gonna get every officer that will hear you out, but you may get one officer that'll hear you. And the reason why I say that is because I'm a living witness of it. These same officers from the sergeants to the lieutenants to the captains.